In the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent by God to a town in Galilee called Nazareth to a young woman engaged to a man whose name was Joseph of the house of David. The young woman's name was Mary. And he came to her and said, Greetings, favored one, the Lord is with you. But she was much perplexed by his words and pondered what sort of greeting this may be. The angel said to her, Do not be afraid, Mary, for you have found favor with God. And now you will conceive in your womb and bear a son, and you will name him Jesus. He will be great and will be called the Son of the Most High. And the Lord God will give to him the throne of his ancestor David. He will reign over the house of Jacob forever, and of his kingdom there will be no end. In those days, a decree went out from Emperor Augustus that all the world should be registered. And this was the first registration taken while Quirinius was the governor of Syria. All went to their own towns to be registered. Joseph also went from the town of Nazareth in Galilee to Judea and the city of David called Bethlehem because he was descended from the house and family of David. He went to be registered with Mary to whom he was engaged and was also expecting a child. While they were there, the time came for her to deliver a child, and she gave birth to her firstborn son and wrapped him in bands of cloth and laid him in a manger because there was no place for them in the inn. Clean up on aisle two. child is this who lay to rest on Mary's lap is sleeping whom angels greet with anthem sweet while shepherds watch our In that region, there were shepherds living in the fields, watching over their flocks by night. Then an angel of the Lord stood before them, and the glory of the Lord shone around them, and they were terrified. But the angel said to them, Do not be afraid. 
For you see, I am bringing you good news of great joy for all of the people. To you is born this day in the city of David a Savior, who is the Messiah, the Lord. This will be a sign to you. You will find a child wrapped in bands of cloth and lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly host, praising God and saying, Glory to God in the highest heaven, and on earth peace among those whom he favors. When the angels had left them and gone into heaven, the shepherds said to one another, Let us go now to Bethlehem and see this thing that has taken place, which the Lord has made known to us. So they went with haste and found Mary and Joseph and the child lying in the manger. When they saw this, they made known what had been told them about this child, and all who heard it were amazed at what the shepherds told them. But Mary treasured all these words and pondered them in her heart. The shepherds returned, glorifying and praising God for all they had heard and seen, as it had been told to them. Christmas morn. 